Hey y'all, welcome back or welcome to my channel with your fine ass. Sitting over there looking like that, coming over here looking like that. Oh my god. <laughs> so today I am back for part two. The canvas body glaze review. Okay. So these are the OG scents. These are the first scents that she came out with. And I ain't got now one cent, okay? Because $25 is just a little bit too much for me to be committing to a big eight ounce jar of something that I really don't like like that, okay? So I'm so glad she came out with these samples where I could be able to smell them and have them all, okay? And have them all and then decide which ones I actually want to order a big jar of. And without further ado, we gonna get into it. First thing we have y'all is falling for you. Let's see what it's hitting for. Yo, I like this. I like this. I like this. It's definitely giving. I was just going to say it's giving fall. Well, it's falling for you. I guess that's the vibe of it. It's definitely giving fall. It's smelling like. All the, all the fall scents, y'all. And I love fall. Like, fall is my most favorite time of the year. So, I am in love with this right now. Oh, my gosh. It smells so good. Oh, my gosh. The next scent we got is Birthday Frosting. Oh, okay. I, whew, I didn't have to put that one all up on my nose, honey. This one is smelling. It is kicking, okay? Right on up out of that little jar, okay? It's very sweet. It's very strong. And it smells just like what it says. Birthday frosting. Like it literally smells just like frosting on a white cake. Like literally but buttercream frosting basically. Now, smells good. I love it. But it's not a for me scent because it's too sweet for me. I am not a person that likes to go around smelling like candies and things like that. And sweets. Mm -mm. I like it, but it's not for me. It's good. If you like super sweet stuff, if you like frostings and coatings and candies, and this is probably one that you will be into for sure because it is giving sweet. <laughs> the next one we got is pineapple upside down cake, honey. And they even got the upside down part upside down and backwards. Honey, I was about to flip it and turn it and I... You know what? They're not finna have me out here looking crazy on this camera, okay? So let's get into it and see what it's hitting for. That smells good. It smells good. I smell the pineapple, but it also smells like... Yeah, I smell the pineapple. I smell the cream. It smells like a cake. It does. It smells cakey-like. It smells cakey-like. It does. It's. I just smelled this pineapple frost. I mean, this birthday frosting. And it's smelling like the undertones of that, which is, you know, the cake part of it. I smell the cake. I do. Good job. Do, very good job. Very good job. Is it for me? No, because it's too sweet. I guess it's Salmo, Simo, Sima, Simo, something like that. Okay. I think this is um, a masculine scent. Let's see. Mmm. Oh. Oh, oh, y'all, I like this. I like this a lot. I'm definitely more of a sandalwood, masculine scent type of person, and I love this. Oh, this is good. Oh. Oh, yeah, that smelled good. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Let me get myself together. Next, we have marshmallow toast. Hmm. It smells like marshmallows. It really does. I'm surprised though. 
Why am I surprised? I'm surprised because I thought it was going to be a lot stronger. Like I thought it was going to punch me in the face a little bit more, but it doesn't. And I'm appalled because I think I like it. I didn't think I would like anything that smells like marshmallows. I like it. It's good. I think it smells like marshmallows, but then I also think it has like a little masculine undertone as well. So I think that's probably why I like it because it has that masculine undertone and it's not like super duper strong on the marshmallow part. Let me smell it again. Hmm. I like it. It smells vanilla. -y, it smells marshmallow. -y. It smells a little musky a little bit. Yeah, I like it. I'm surprised. Yes. The next one we have is caramel creme brulee. Oh my God, this is strong. This is strong and it definitely punched me. Definitely punched me a little, woo. Yeah, hold this one back. I smell ya. I smell ya. You're strong, baby. You're strong. Oh. Oh. This is enough to give me a headache because it's so strong and the, and the smell is so potent. Whew, if you like to be a real sweet, sugary smelling girly girl, uh, this one right here is for you. Ooh, mm -mm. It's not for me. I smell the cream. I smell the caramel and then it brulees you in the face. Okay. <laughs> This is strong. This is really strong. Next, we have Drunken Peach. Okay, I like it. The peach is not super duper strong, which is what I thought it was going to be since it's a fruit. I thought it was going to be super strong and punch me in the face, but it doesn't. It's a nice peach scent. It's not too strong. And it's not too sweet smelling. I like it. I will put it on my skin. All right. The next one we have is one of their famous ones, which is cream puff. I kind of smell like the banana cream pie. Just a little bit. Definitely kind of smells like it. I like it. I like it. It's hitting. The next one we have is Sima, 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 whatever it is. Okay, I'm taking it. This is the feminine version of that. It's given a perfume. And it's okay. Mm, as I smell it more, I smell it. It's like coming alive more. Okay. I like it. I do. I like it. It didn't make me feel or do what the other one did, but I like it. It smells pretty good. I put it on my skin. All right. The next one. We got here is Sent From Heaven, which is another really popular one. See, I've almost ordered this scent a few times. And I'm glad I didn't because I'm not sure if I like it. I like it, but then there's some undertones in there that I don't think I like. I would try it on my skin, though, because it's not a bad scent. I would try it on my skin. I would give it a go. And so next we have another one of their very popular scents in the OG kit is Strawberry Shortcake. Let's see what it's hitting for. I 
I like this. <laughs> I like it. I do. I like it. Mm, I'm trying to figure out because the strawberries, it almost is like an artificial smelling strawberry a little bit. Just a little bit. But then you smell that cake. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I like this. I would definitely put this on my skin, honey. You smell like a real snack with this one. Okay, the next one we have is the super duper original, 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 honey. And this is the donuts. It says icing for the skin. I think this is one of the original scents, like the first one that ever came out. So I want to really try this one. See what's it for. I didn't think I would like something that smells like a donut. Does it smell like a donut? It smells like the banana cream pie to me. And y'all know how I feel about that banana cream pie. So I like this. I like this a lot. Out of trying all of them, now I see that they actually have three scents that kind of smell alike. Okay. So that is the icing for the skin, the donut one, and the cream puff, and the banana cream pie. I feel like those three smell almost just alike, just like different levels of the smell. Like the banana cream pie is like boom. It's powerful. The cream puff is like a notch down from that. And then I feel like the icing for the skin is a notch down from that. So I feel like those are the, it's like a level with those. But from this grouping, my top three are thirdly being the donut, the icing for the skin. Why? Because I think it smells like the banana cream pie definitely think that it does it smells like it and i love the banana cream pie so yeah this is number three on my top three list then there is falling for you oh my god <laughs> oh mm. smells so much like fall like it literally smells like leaves it smells like autumn when you go outside it smells y'all it just it's it smells it smells like it, it does it smells like fall time okay if you're a fall girly then you'll probably like this then number one number one on my list is salma simo somebody's mo i love it though okay yes oh no 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 i like that one a lot i do i like that one a lot <laughs> so Hey, do y'all have a favorite? Do y'all like one of these? Have y'all smelled them? Are y'all curious, honey? If you haven't, then listen, take my word forward, okay? I'm going to tell you the truth and nothing less. Believe that. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those post notifications so that you can be notified whenever I drop another video with your fine ass. Mm.